Today's story is Are You an Ant? by Judy Allen and Tudor Humphreys. Are you an ant? If you are, your mother is a queen. One hot summer day, she went on a mating flight with thousands of others so that she would be able to lay eggs. Afterward, she flew down to the ground. She knew she didn't need her wings anymore, so she took them off. Then she dug herself a small room underground. Now that she is in her room, the queen begins to lay eggs. You are in one of them. Hatch out of the egg as soon as you can. You don't look like an ant yet. You're a larva and you're hungry. There are eggs all over the place. Eat some. It's all right. They won't mind. They're only eggs. Soon you must change into a pupa. A pupa is a little like an egg, only bigger. When you're ready, break out. You look almost like an ant, but you're white and soft. Don't worry. Slowly your skin will become hard and black, and you'll look perfect. There are a lot of others like you. You are one of a big family. You are a worker. Work hard to build a nest. Dig storage rooms and nurseries and bedrooms and corridors. It's all right. You don't have to work alone. The others will work with you. You don't have any voices, but you can talk to each other by touching feelers. Don't eat any more eggs. Go out and hunt for food. Seeds are nice. So are bugs and wood lice. Springtails are delicious, but hard to catch because they jump. Bite your prey and spray it with acid from your tail. Actually, you're not a very good hunter. Look for bugs that have been stepped on. They're easy. You may think there's easy food in kitchens, but be careful. There are crumbs and grains of sugar, which are nice. There are also people, and they're not so nice. People don't like you in their homes. They may squash you. They may poison you. Or they may sweep the floor so you can't find anything to eat. The best food is honeydew. It comes from aphids. Find a plant with aphids feeding on it. March up the stem with the other workers. Now stroke an aphid until it gives you a drop of honeydew. It's a little like milking a cow, but you wouldn't know about that. You're an ant. Take care of your aphids. Ladybugs eat aphids, so look for ladybug eggs and throw them away. You must take food back to the nest. Some you can lift, some you can drag, some you can put in your second stomach. It's called a crop and it's very useful for carrying spare food home. Back at the nest, there's plenty to do. Feed the queen, who is still laying eggs. Feed the larvae, who are still hatching. Take care of the eggs and larvae. When it's cold, carry them deep into the nest where it's cozy. When the sun warms the ground, carry them up near the surface. Oh, and don't forget to take out the garbage. Life isn't all food and work. There's danger too. Birds and lizards and toads think you are good to eat. Some birds pick you up and push you under their wings. Why? Because the acid in your body kills the ticks that bite them and make them itch. This is called anting. Anting is nice for birds. Anting is not nice for ants. However, 
If your family looks a little like this, or this, or this, you are not an aunt. You are a human child. You don't have to take care of eggs and larvae. You don't have to milk aphids. You probably don't have to march in a line with a lot of others. Don't worry. You can do many things that ants can't do. Best of all, no bird is ever, ever, ever going to pick you up in its beak and stuff you under its wings. Did you know the ants in this book are black garden ants? But there are about 10,000 different kinds of ants living all over the world. Some grow their own food. South American leaf cutter ants carry pieces of leaves home and chew them up to make compost for their fungus gardens. Some hunters, thousands of African driver ants, march in long columns, eating any animal in their path if it doesn't escape in time. Some collect seeds and fruits and honeydew. These ants leave a scent trail to guide their worker sisters to the food. Some ants can sting, so be careful. Thanks for watching Storytime with Miss Rose. If you liked the video, make sure to subscribe and click the notification bell for more videos. Don't forget to hit the like button and leave a comment down below. If you enjoyed the book, there's a link to purchase in the description below. Thank you.